Hi, I'm Shabazz and welcome to WCTS. Hi, I'm Ling and we're the International Sports Coordinator. And I'm Abbas. Let's take a look around WCGS. This is the Mass Corridor and um, yeah, this is where uh, all our Mass lessons take place. Um, as you can see on the right is the pastoral office, so like, if you want to see the Deputy Master, which is um, Mrs. Owen, um, you can just go in and have a word with her. On the right here is the toilet, um, yeah, that's obviously for the toilet. And this is where we register, like, we have to place our finger on here, it's a new way. Um, this is a science classroom, so obviously biology, chemistry or physics will take place in there. And yeah, this all along here now is just maths classroom, so we have like maths 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. And yeah, so from year 7, year 8, year 9, year 10, year 11, year 12 and year 13, all maths lessons are most likely to take place in here. And maybe one more classroom, which is in the sixth form centre. Um, yeah. So uh, let's have a look, let's see, yeah, let's take an insight into one of these maths lessons. And um, so year 10 class. Um, Guys, would you like to see the camera? What are you guys studying? Algebraic fractions. Algebraic fractions. So, have you seen this in Sri Lanka? Let's see if you're doing it as well. Every morning, hundreds of students pour through the school in different entrances here and there around the site. Over here, you can go up to art departments, to maths, and to all sorts of subjects. And my favourite part is here. Pictures of the old students, captains, sportsmen, the whole school as well. You can see how the school has changed over time. Over here, we have the school captains, as you'll see as you come. Um, our current captain will go here. And this is a place that people generally tend to kind of walk through on the way to them. If we walk down here, we can see the hall known as the beating heart of our school. Everything from examinations to uh, events to music festivals to dramas, everything happens here. Um, we... What we have here is the house system in which students of different houses from within the same class would compete in sports, in uh, poetry, in arts, in all sorts of activities. And at the end, they all fight for the prestigious Cockhouse Cup. And every year we have loads of competitions with flags representing who's won uh, and golden names representing who's achieved at this school. And um, it, it's a fundamental part of our school system here at WCGS.
Plot. As you can see, right. You can see Why have they been? Why is so much of your attention being based on plot? Because we're working it out ourselves. Right. Okay, so you're making it so because you so that you're making it and why when you make that yourself? Why not? Why can you not get good acting marks if your story isn't good? You're not being assessed on your Right guys, so this is a sports hall and as you can see this is the staff um, area where like, all the sports teachers are and over here is the gym so obviously all the students can use it and yeah, should we take a look? Working out over here, um, yeah it's a very good vibe you know, loving the music, well done you won. So yeah, so like obviously these are six form students over here. Obviously year seven, year eight, year nine, year ten, year eleven. You can also use the gym and facilities available. Yeah, so have a quick look around. Alright, so guys, that was the gym. Let's take a look at the sports hall. Just follow me. The gym. Um, so this is where like indoor sessions happen. So for the girls, it's um, netball. For the boys, it can be basketball, indoor football, and even in the winter, obviously cricket nets. And obviously in the summer there's cricket nets as well, but that usually takes place outdoors. As you can see, these are just photos on the side. Um, do you want to have a take a look in? Yeah. yeah, so guys, this is the sports hall actually inside it, which actually I think cost around 1.3 million if I'm correct. So yeah, a lot of money was spent on it, but it does look absolutely gorgeous. So yeah guys, as you can see this is the field, so this is where our rugby matches take place, um, obviously in the summer the cricket matches take place, and yeah, let's have a look.